everything changes. So today is our last day in Phuket. Uh, at, um, at about 6 p.m. we've booked ourselves a mini shuttle bus to get us to the Phuket airport from Hatong Beach and then we are going off to Manila, Philippines which will be really awesome because we are excited for that. Alright, so we just uh, we just rode our motorcycle down, down this huge hill. I was like, I hope we're gonna make this. Hedge. It's like, yeah, we got it down this. Yeah, hill. this is what like, the hill looks like. Hill. Yep, we came down this hill. And this is where we came down to see. We are about to swim with elephants. Yeah, this is Tritung Beach, and the the owner of this uh, elephant brings them out to give them a bath and we prefer this versus uh, just the way that people go and pay in other places so yeah we are here at the beach and there's a couple here taking their pictures with the uh, with the elephant it's really lovely I think it's a honeymoon so really glad you guys came along for this it's gonna be a lot of fun Alright, so we just got done swimming with these awesome, awesome elephants here. So it was very, very cool. So if you do end up, if you ever come to Phuket, we definitely recommend you come and try this. It's about 500 baht, which is $14 for each person. You get 20 minutes. And I think it's totally worth it. I mean, where else are you going to go and find elephants not in a zoo? And, and not only do you swim with them, they pick you up with their trunk and they throw you. So, literally. a lot of amazing things to do here in Phuket and yeah, just enjoying the travels. Oh. <laughs> here we are on the beach. We just swam with the elephants. So guys, if you've been watching our vlogs, you probably know that in Leicester I got stung by a jellyfish. Well, this is what they look like. See if you can yeah. flip it around. Okay, maybe the water will do it. Don't touch it! There we go. So it's you can jellyfish. see jellyfish. This is what stung me yesterday. This jelly, the cousin of this jellyfish and the four yesterday. babies stung Patrick.
right, so we're back in Patong Beach and we just got ourselves some milk to drink after being on a swimming with the elephants and we are on a search because I have been having no shoes all day. Uh, He's been riding a moped with no shoes. Yeah, I didn't bring flip flops with me because I thought it would be cheaper to buy them here, which turns out is not because flip flops are two dollars here when I could have bought a dollar from a from a store back home. So I need to buy flip flops. So I've been riding without flip flops, which is not a good idea, but I'm still walking around without flip flops. Thankfully, here they do not have a no shoes, no service policy. So yeah. I'm going to show you guys what the airport looks like at 1 in the morning. Our bedroom for the night. And like every foreigner in this airport is wearing these pants, I just have to say. <laughs> A couple people spending the night. They're spending the night here. They already made themselves all nice and cozy. So, now my mission as a husband is to go and find some cardboard paper so that I can make a bed for my wife and I to sleep down on in the airport. So, I finally get to exercise my caveman abilities. Build a shelter. Right. So, this is where I have to kind of do one of those foreigner rants. And I'm going to say shame on you thailand shame shame on you especially phuket international airport foreigners miss their flights and with all the money you collect through tourism through all the visa applications this is what we get for a bed and if you're a foreigner in thailand and you miss your flight you are gonna spend the night on the floor and it is what it is even though you spend so much money here buying a lot of stuff and paying for visa applications it just doesn't matter yep he missed his flight yep they missed their flight too Right, finally we're leaving Thailand. After yeah. 10 hours in this airport, we're so actually nice. walking down our plane. Yeah, it's so awesome being able to leave now. And we're going to Singapore. By Which Singapore. Was a yeah. So we might actually get out of the airport in Singapore and get to look around Singapore for a little bit. Yeah, we have a five something hour layover. Yeah, so that'll be pretty good. Alright, see you guys. <laughs> 